hi everyone okay let's provide a solution to this problem we have x plus 2 to the power of 2 equals 25 the first target is to remove the square from here and we have x plus 2 squared right oh i wanted to remove the square so because of that I can take the law um the square root of both sides. But on the right we have positive or negative square root of 25. Now this is going to go with this one. Now we have x plus 2 to be equal to plus or minus 5. Because oh there's supposed to be square root of um 25 over there. Right? Now, here is what we are going to do. From here, we are having two values. One is positive 5 and the other is negative 5. So, we are going to have two equations then. x plus 2 equals 5 or x plus 2 equals negative 5. So, the next thing is to solve them separately. So, I am going to work with this. From here, x plus 2 equals 5. So, let's take 2 to the other side. As we have x plus 2. To remove this 2 now, we'll subtract 2. Then we have 5. These 2 that we are subtracting should reflect on the other side. Now, x, this and this will go. 5 minus 2 is equal to 3. So this means that one of the values of x is x equals 3. Okay, the next is to bring this down here and continue. So I'm going to pick um, x plus 2 equals negative 5. So this means that x plus 2 minus 2 is equal to negative 5 minus 2. This is it over here. Okay, so that this can take this away. Now we have x, right, to be equal to negative 5, negative 2 will give negative 7. So this is the value. So we're having that x, right, is equal to um, the first one, which is 3, or x is equal to negative 7 but like we always do we verify our work so let's go into the verification stage the real equation is x plus 2 to the power of 2 equals 25 now the first value of x is is um, 3 so we had x to be equal to 3 and then x to be equal to negative 7 you can see them over here so now let's put in the value of x which is 3 so we now have 3 plus 2 to the power of 2 would this give 5 it will because this is 3 plus 2 and it's 5 in the bracket to the power of 2 and 5 to the power of 2 is 25 so the first value of x which is this satisfies the equation now let's get the second value which is minus 7 so we'll have minus 3 in place of x now we'll write minus 7 sorry that is minus 7 then plus 2 this is raised to the power of 2 Will this give 7? The answer is yes. Because this right here, minus 7 plus 2, is minus 3 to the power of 2. Minus 3 to the power of 2. And um, is it 3? Okay, it's minus 5. My bad. So it's minus 5 to the power of 2. And um, we will now square what we have here. That will give us minus 5 multiplied by minus 5. 
negative negative is positive then 5 times 5 is 25 okay so this equally means that the second value which is x equals negative 7 satisfies the equation and the equation still remains x plus 2 to the power of 2 equals 25. Thank you for watching.